And before you start guys, as usual, don't forget leave a like, it will really help me create all these tutorials every day only for you. And of course subscribe. And of course uh, guys, it is... Look at this. It is simply awesome, awesome stuff. Open Minecraft Launcher as usual and go in Minecraft Java Edition Installation. Here find Udison. Uh, no Udison, tap new and type Udison YouTube. Press create. Press left mouse button on Udison and in the list find If you install for Minecraft 1.18, choose option release 1.18. If you install for Minecraft 1.18.4, for example, choose option release 1.18.4 and so on. I hope you understand Prince. After that, press save button and press play button on Udison. Wait several seconds. After that, you must see Minecraft Close Minecraft and Close Minecraft Launcher. Open your download section and find Forge Installer. Use Installer version with jar file. Uh, double check right version. If you install for Minecraft 1.18, download Forge for Minecraft 1.18. If you install for Minecraft 1.18.2, for example, choose option Forge 1.18.2. And so on. Anyway, double click. Press OK. After that, you must see something, okay, blah, 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 and cool. Also, guys, uh, don't forget, we have udison.com site where you can find tons of different text tutorials for Minecraft and another popular sandbox games and Discord where you can talk about all this cool stuff. If you successfully install it, you see this complete, this blue logo successfully install it, blah, blah, blah. Uh, close the school stuff. Mm, open Minecraft Launcher again. Uh, find... Wait a second. Of course it is very laggy because it is Minecraft, why not? <laughs> Go in installation. Here find Forge installer. Double check this Forge in this list must have right version. If you install for Minecraft 1.18, you must see release 1.18 Forge. If you install for Minecraft 1.18.2, you must see here release 1.18.2 Forge and so on. Also sometimes install new version of Forge for latest version of Minecraft. It is also a uh, good idea. Anyway, uh, press this folder on the for uh, here find folder name mods. Yes, we small letters. No have this folder, not big deal. Simply create folder. Double click and open this folder. Uh, wait a second. After that, uh, drag and drop in mods folder world, world handler. Pay attention on the numbers on this file. By default, first numbers it is version of Minecraft. So, if you install for Minecraft 1.18, you must see file with name world for, for handler 1.18. If you install for Minecraft 1.18.2, you must see world handler 1.18.2 and another numbers. Anyway, and so on and so on. I hope you understand principle. Drop world handler, jar file inside mods folder, open Minecraft launcher, find forger. Double check the name of the forger. Here the deal. For Minecraft 1.18, you must see release 1.18 forger. For Minecraft 1.18.2, you see something release 1.18.2 forger, and so on and so on. I hope you understand principle. After that, choose right version, press save button, press play button, and let's go. Install properly in mods list you find world handler. Okay, how this mod work? Extremely easy. In many and other videos I show you tons of different codes. Usually you activate in the chat with and tap manually very long command, for example, locate uh, jungle pyramid uh, and so on. If you want locate somewhere somehow for teleport you use another long command. It is harmful because it's all this stuff extremely long. Uh, you can always press uh, escape, options, controls, keybind, and here find and remember this world handler keybind, web button in our situation, but I prefer to change this button, press left mouse button and press this button. Very important stuff is this button have another color, for example, red color, it means uh, this keybind already use another mods and in this situation this world and handler not work for you. In this situation simply press left mouse button, choose free keybind and you see fight keybind and this means you use free keybind and finally it is work for you. Press this keybind button and you see, ok, time noon. Uh, wait a second. What the hell? 
Hello. Oh. Why I am? <laughs> I believe I have wrong place. Go in wrong place. Yo my god. Oh my god. Was new world generation. It is something seriously. Mm, wait a second. Why not uh, choose right game mode? Game mode. Uh, ta -ta 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 -ta. Player. Um, Miscellaneous. Clear inventory. No, 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 no. Experience. Give more experience. Add. Advancement. Oh, player. Back. Item blocks. Game mode spectractor. Game mode creative. Press one button and now I am game mode creative. Wow. Press one button. I am in spectractor. Forget about text command. Seriously. I love this stuff already. Get common stack. Wow. So I not understand potions. I want, for example, fire resistance and give and ambient particles and yes, glowing has the and Okay, second Hasta and potions and back to game. Where are my potions? Arrow, arrow to swiftness. Okay, maybe potions work. Conduit power. I think I need simply potion in my bare hand. Place. No effect here. Then activate this menu. Potions, conduit power, uh, 19 effect, effect, give, applied effect for me, wow, potions, conduit power, for example, give, ambient, particles, minutes, Okay, maybe I want glow fire resistance for 1990 hours and give. Uh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Remove all, give fire resistance for 1990 hours. Uh -huh. I want battle. Okay, cool. So it is a uh, neat time to explore how all this stuff work, but it's extremely cool because I choose option give, I choose different options. After that, I choose I want arrow, I want splash potion, I want bottle with normal potion, linger effect, and so on. Now I have uncraftable potion with 600 fire resistance for uh, 99 hours. Oh my god. Cool. Simply cool, guys. Also, so here the popular options for difficulty, for game mode, and for weather. Uh, also, you can give yourself different items. Uh, for example, I want dirt. I want dirt because dirt it is cool. Uh, I can place lore attribution and press give also i can choose uh, color default like so for this name and press give so oh my god wow give items the world okay game rules so you can choose everything what you need in this menu. So if you love this work with command, but I hate and you hate um, procedure where I must um, learn all this text command. This mod definitely for you. I want. I hope you like this idea. Uh, it is a menu with uh, different commands. Wow. Simply wow, Mojang, why you not add this stuff in uh, Minecraft, seriously?